Hello, everybody. You're in a record episode of me speaking as well as just updating, I guess. Um, so I've been meaning to do this for about a week and a half, but I guess now is the right time to discuss this topic. So, <clears throat> I'm pretty sure a lot of people are probably wondering where I am, what is my standings with certain communities and my opinions on a few things that happened. Um, certain things that happened over the past week I am not going to mention. Um, however, I am going to make this much. I've come a very, very long way from starting a channel that reached 70 subscribers that I thought was never going to happen and that channel being deleted due to my account being hacked about three months ago actually no, about a year and a half ago and now me starting up this account that you guys are watching on just in November of 2017 it doesn't, it does not seem like I should be at 159 subscribers right now it really doesn't and this channel Right now, as of the 22nd of April, right, 22nd of April, 2018, was made November 6, 2016, and has 2,932 views with 159 subscribers. That is is just mind-boggling itself like it just does not seem like I should be able to get to that level and still be able to just not thank you guys um I don't think I've ever actually thanked every anyone um I just want to say thank you for everything that happens thank you for making everything happen you every you watching this you're the one that actually allows me to stay here and produce everything that I do. Um, you guys were the one that motivated me to be to actually get a computer and now I have one and now I can do a lot more things. I can not necessarily edit correctly because <laughs> let's just say I'm still learning on how to use Sony Vegas. Um, I've had it for about a day and a half. I don't know. I'm really lazy too so who knows, um, I've already spent over two hours editing on how it is normally, um, yeah, so basically, uh, I know a couple people are asking me, where am I on roleplay standards, um, kind of switching topics here a little bit, but that's okay, um, You know, roleplay standards, I'm currently still the executive director of San Andreas Roleplay. Um, I am as well. San Andreas Roleplay is probably going to be shut down eventually because the community is not active. It's, it's just not. I can't. I have to be honest. The community is just not active. It's not there it's not it's not worth all the time and effort that I put into the community for it just to be nothing um, we have 17 members and only four are active I mean I've had a lot going on in my personal life and I guess that might be conflicting some of the um, issues within there however that it shouldn't be like that, you know? Like, the community shouldn't be that dead. But... I don't know. I have found a official home for roleplay. I know I've said this before. I said it was San Andreas Reborn. And I said it with, um, Los Angeles City of Emergency Services. I said it with the old SARP. And I said it with the new SARP. Um... Don't mind my driving. I just wanted to get rid of the hood, to be honest. Um, but, like... <sighs> I 
Eclipse Roleplay. I'm now in Eclipse Roleplay. I'm the Chief of Police at Eclipse Roleplay. Their community website is going to be down in the description below. So go ahead and check that out. But, other than that... Midwest RP. Let's just take a second and talk about Midwest, right? Whilst my character is swimming underwater and possibly having a spasm attack, um, what happened with Midwest RP? Um, I am not allowed to give a full statement yet. However, head administration has told us what we can say and what we cannot say. So basically. Midwest Andrew was overthrown about a week ago, and he was overthrown by head administration. This is currently known to the public. Um, however, the backstory that's not known. Midwest Andrew was banned and overthrown because he broke multiple community rules. He demeaned and harassed members of the community. He lowered their self-esteem as well as basically just downing them completely. Um, he made fun of the fire chief with Dyslexia. Dyslexia. He also made fun of JM, our lead server developer, who um, he basically demeaned Jane, Jam, so Jesus Christ, Jay, and called him, um, the full thing I'm not allowed to release, but he basically harassed Jay to the point of where Jay broke down and had to go to Nick B, the assistant deputy director of the community. Um, so that happened, and that's the public statement we're allowed to release. Um, Louis Andrew was overthrown and banned. People don't know the backstory behind it. That's why he was removed from the community, and, you know. Um, but Midwest RP is still standing, very, very strong. Community.midwestrp.net is the website we still have. We're still accepting five to six applications a day, and still bringing in a lot of people. We're st I mean, we had to create a new Discord, and we're still sitting at 300 and something members. So, the community is doing very, very well for itself, and it's not failing anytime soon. So, for anyone saying otherwise, it's wrong, and it is incorrect. Um, <clears throat> so, basically, just thought I'd give you guys that update. Um, the video should return on a schedule within the month. Um, I'm just really soon as I have the free time right now, but once summer rolls around... A lot more free time, however, will open up. And I'll be able to do a lot more things. Um, I'll also be able to stand here and, you know, do streams and everything again. Um, I haven't been able to do those in a very, very long time. And I do miss them. Trust me, I do. So, I'll try to do a stream... Um, sometime during May. I know it's a very long ways away, but it's the only time I really get the free time to go and do things. So, yeah. But I thought I should give you guys a statement on what happened. As well as a statement on where I am and what my standings are. Uh, I'm doing very well for myself right now. Um... I know it does seem like a very long time since I've been able to produce active content. Um, if I seem to have any of my videos, don't worry about it. Just no. I, I think I have a problem. Instead of recording during the day, I record 3 in the morning, 2 a.m., 6 a.m., either really early or really late. And that's just a personal issue that I do. And I'm unable to control it just because this is the time where I think of the idea and I'm like, hey. Let's go do this. Um, some of my YouTube videos are filmed in the afternoon. And my voice does sound groggy. Um, 
Hold on, let me just get a sip of water real quick. Um, <clears throat> maybe my voice won't sound so groggy now. Um, that might help just a little bit. I have no idea though. If it does, yay. If it doesn't, oh well. But basically, that is gonna conclude this episode. Um, I just really wanted to tell you guys what was happening and where I still stand. So, my name is Garrett, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. And peace out.